If you could remain standing and please stand, Vivian Lee and Aditi Rawat will lead us in the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing. Nikhil Mula will be presenting the national anthem. Oh. 
What so proudly we hail at the twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight, or the ramparts we wash were so gallantly streaming. And the rocket's red glare, the bombs bursting in air, gave proof through the night that our flag was still there. Oh, say does that star-spangled banner yet wave or the land of the free and the home of the brave. Please be seated. Good evening, and welcome to the 59th Commencement Ceremony for John P. Stevens High School, Class of 2023. I would like to introduce several people on the stage. Acting Superintendent of Schools, Dr. Edward Alderelli. Chief Academic Officers, Ms. Gail Polakowski and Ms. Beninder Gomer. <laughs> Board of Education President, Ms. Shannon Peng. <laughs> Vice President, Mr. Joseph Romano. <laughs> and Board of Education Members, Mr. Baral Patel, Mr. Mohan Patel, Mr. Vishal Patel, Mr. Douglas Schneider, Mr. Brian Rivera, Mr. Jerry Shee, and Miss Virginia White. Six exceptional educators are retiring this year. They have guided thousands of students in the pursuit of critical thinking, sparking curiosity, and inspiring higher levels of learning. They dedicated time outside the school day to provide extended opportunities for learning, as well as guiding and encouraging mastery in their areas of expertise. They have made a difference in our school community, and they have pushed us to be better educators and people. They have supported JP students for a combined total of 190 years. We are privileged to have had the opportunity to work beside them and learn from them. Retirees, thank you for all you have done for our students. Congratulations and best wishes for a long, happy, and healthy retirement. Our exceptional JPS retirees, please stand. Ms. Jody Catafamo. <laughs> Mr. Leo Danik. Mr. Andy DiNicola, Ms. Kathy McKeon, Ms. Randy Petroselli, and Ms. Eileen Plesnarski. Thank you. Parents and friends to the class of 2023, congratulations to you. While I am sure you are proud of your children, you should be proud of yourselves. Look at what you have done here today. You have instilled the value of education and the importance of being a kind and caring member of the community. You have shared your child with us for all these years. And I promise you, 
your child has received an exceptional education. The teachers, counselors, and staff members in front of you are incredible educators who only want the best for your child. They have challenged them in and out of the classroom, academically, spending countless hours outside of the school day to ensure your children receive the best education. They are a dedicated group of professionals, and as a result, your children are prepared for the next phase in their lives. Teachers, counselors, and staff, thank you for the care and support you have provided our students. And to the class of 2023, congratulations. You have all made a positive impact on our school community. You have achieved great heights in and out of the classroom. Your accolades and accomplishments are too many to share here, academically, athletically, musically, and through co-curriculars, you have achieved numerous awards. You all have contributed in one way or another to the building our school community. At the start of the school year, I asked you to believe. Believe in yourselves, in each other, and in your ability to set goals and accomplish them step by step. Eleanor Roosevelt said, the future belongs to those who believe in the beauty of their dreams. I ask you to continue believing in your dreams. It is believing in your dreams and continuing to take the small steps every day towards your dreams that gives you the ability to achieve them. Even when it seems impossible, like when there's a pandemic and you have to learn via Zoom, you can take the small steps, take risks and try something new. You have grown and achieved and challenged in these four years of high school to be the capable, accomplished individuals we are seeing here today. You believed in each other by supporting each other. You believed in yourself. You took the steps of helping each other, whether it be arriving early or staying late, helping a member on a team or working on a project, tutoring a peer, sharing your breakfast, or just stopping by their locker to say hi. You attended musical and theatrical and sporting events, cheering your friends on. In the pursuit of your dreams, remember to believe in yourself and each other. Support each other. Continue to be kind, caring, supportive, and humble. Because when you believe in the future your dr and your dreams, the future is yours. We will miss you, Class of 2023, but we can't wait to hear all about your adventures at Alumni Day. Continue to believe, and congratulations to the class of 2023. And now, it is my pleasure to introduce the salutatorian of your class, Justin Tam. Hello, before I start, let's take a quick point five. Perfect. Good afternoon, administrators, faculty, families, and the J.P. Stevens Class of 2023. I'm Justin, and to the classmates I've never met, which is not a lot due to the very limited number of students in our grade, we went to high school together. Today is an exciting day, to say the least. Starting tomorrow, we won't, we won't be squished in the hallways, have to wait in long lines in the cafeteria for pizza, or complain about the lack of air conditioning. Four years ago, I considered high school a true stepping stone in my journey to who knows where. It would be just four years of my life when school would get a little tougher, the number of sleepless nights would quickly accumulate, and my time logged on Fortnite would slowly die from 10 hours a week to zero. But these past years have been anything but typical years of our lives, starting out fresh, then being thrown into the pandemic that gave us the chance to study from home. At first, I was excited for the extra 30 minutes of sleep I got each day, but it came at a cost. I began to miss the shoving in the hallways and the quick chats with my friends during passing, 
that were replaced by the fixing of my bed head before logging onto Zoom each morning and the constant, I can't hear you, I think you're muted. I simply existed through each day, completing assignments and watching YouTube. Interactions with people turned into waiting for my teachers to let me into their Zoom meeting rooms. Surprisingly, the pandemic uncovered the treasure of going to school in person, of physically interacting with others. When we were finally back together at JP, we were able to engage with each other again. We cheered on our student athletes at each pep rally, attended concerts hosted by the wonderful musicians in our class, went to Disney and Six Flags, showed our truly unparalleled school spirit. And who can forget the most stressful time of our senior year, when we finally realized that high school is indeed not the end of our lives. We prepared to advertise extremely exaggerated best versions of ourselves, whether for our 20 plus college applications, job interviews, or prom date search. We looked for new communities, homes to be a part of, places like JP where we could connect with others. We chose to pick up new, never before seen treasure maps and look forward, despite the feelings of panic and anxiety that would sometimes get the best of us. High school is a unique combination of individuality and community. And while this is so incredibly cliche, most of us discovered our true selves in high school, hobbies, personality, pursuits, by being with others. We brought the best out of each other, competing fiercely in the classroom during the day, then dancing our hearts out at prom, or waiting in the photo booth line for an hour and being so surprised they made the photos public that you had to make some calls just to keep some of those moments not so public. Treasure the little things. Cherish your relationships and memories with others. Never forget the impact that this community of high-flying hawks has had on you. But also, reach for more. Expand your horizons and pursue new relationships. And so, I'd like to thank the other members of this tight-knit community. Starting with the teachers and staff, thank you for always believing in us and seeing our potential before we ever came close to realizing it. Thank you to our parents and families for always being there, whether for a listening ear, a shoulder to cry on, or a gentle reminder that we still had homework to do. And finally, thank you to the JP class of 2023 for the multitude of lasting friendships I formed and the stress and fun I endured alongside each and every one of you. I'll miss our interactions in the hallways, the scrambling to class during sweeps, everything about the culture we created that was truly a treasure to experience. And so, wherever you go, remember to continue to make meaningful connections and don't be afraid to explore and take unexpected paths, for who knows where your next treasure map will take you. Thank you and congratulations. And now your valedictorian, Sophia Arti Aurora. I think I will have to bring this down a lot. Um, I wasn't gonna do this, but Justin took a photo, and so I think I definitely have to. Oh, I think you blinked. Uh, so, good afternoon. Uh, I want to start by thanking everyone here today who made our journeys through high school possible. Our administration, who works tirelessly to create an encouraging school environment for us. Our faculty, who inspire us daily with their commitment to helping us grow as individuals. Our families and friends, who have supported us in this roller coaster. In my case, my mom. It's actually her birthday today. Happy birthday, mom. <laughs> my dad and the, my dad and my sister. And most importantly, thank you to my friends and classmates, the class of 2023, and the heart of JP. I know that JP has meant something entirely different to each one of us. To me, it's the place where I transformed from a very tiny, timid freshman into a tiny, confident adult who's not afraid to take up space in the hallways, even if that means whacking people with my tote bag. So I'm sincerely sorry if you've ever been on the receiving end of that. For many of us, JP has been the setting for our most meaningful failures, fights, successes, and friendships so far. 
Even after I'm settled far, far away from Edison, I know I'll always remember getting my toes stomped on while dancing during homecoming and rushing through the Tchaikovsky with our orchestra at Lincoln Center and watching the student section go wild when the football team scored during tailgate. I mean, there's no other school that would basically consider Taco Bell to be an extension of their school cafeteria. But as I say farewell to all of you and all those memories and all those seven layer burritos, I feel like I have nothing super profound to say. After all, I'm only 18 and I don't even have my diploma yet. But the only thing I can say is that my idea of a good life has changed a lot in high school. Sure, we've all internalized the idea that nose to the grindstone diligence is all we need to reach success whether that's that cushy job or the right pay grade or a respected social status. But I've seen enough Hallmark movies to know that's not all you need to craft a successful life. So at the end of sophomore year, I took the leap and started going to in-person school classes. I was feeling really small in our huge, mostly empty school with way too much time to kill because there was no cell phone service. I know, horrifying. And so I remember standing alone in our cafeteria, a very surreal feeling, and realizing that I'd been living each day very mindlessly committed to routine, discontent and dissatisfied. So when JP returned to its full glory in our junior year, I was inspired by the love that drives so many of our students here. Sure, love is a famously imprecise word, but I mean it in the sense of an active love, working at things with intention and care. I realized that our musicians here practice not just because you need to work hard to be good at your craft, although that's definitely true, but because they genuinely enjoy the experience of mastering a difficult measure. I learned that our athletes don't wake up at 6 a.m. because they're just so full of willpower. They like seeing their skills improve on the field. And I realized that so many of you participate in community service because you love the work of giving back to those communities that raised us. So I'm still trying to take notes from all that and be more present, more engaged, leading with sincerity and not apathy in, or in order to build a good life for myself. Part of that means that I'm becoming a quitter, um, and it's wonderful to abandon things that I only continue doing out of routine. And when I just have to do things I don't like, I'm really trying to find something to love about them anyway. So I even kind of enjoy my math homework now. Sorry, Mr. Rovnak. Uh, I'm really thankful, though, that JP has shown us that in whatever winding paths we forge, we can all construct futures that allow us to find contentment in our work and to resist apathy I really hope that opens a path to personal success for all of us. Uh, my friend, Philip, recently showed me this note that I wrote in his yearbook from the eighth grade, and I said, and I quote, you're super cool, can't wait for JP. And I know it was super riveting, groundbreaking stuff, but I think I was so right to be excited because there's so much to love about our time at this school. This is the type of class that turned our senior sunset at the local park into an impromptu dance floor. I mean, we're funny and full of camaraderie and unlikely community. And I think we have such a huge capacity for love, service, and creation within us. Our next task after high school is to figure out how to use it to create a life filled with love. Thank you and congratulations to the class of 2023. Now, I am very pleased to introduce Mr. Lee and the JPS Choir and Ms. Stein and the JPS Dance Ensemble, who will perform a song dedicated to the class of 2023. All the graduates who are singing, go ahead on back, get yourself set.
Thank you to our Performing Arts Department. To officially present the class to the Board of Education, our Acting Superintendent, Dr. Edward Alderelli. Good afternoon, graduates. You better than that. Good afternoon, graduates. All right. It is an absolute privilege to stand here before you today as we honor your successes. I, I know I speak for everybody in this arena when I say that we're overwhelmed with pride as we sit back and look at all that you've done throughout this year. You've worked so hard. You've shown resilience, crit, and determination in tackling the rigorous demands and expectations set forth by this wonderful school district. You've accomplished so much in your coursework, you've participated in everything this district has to offer, and your contributions are one of the many reasons why this school district has such an outstanding reputation. Your successes are a result of your character and unmatched determination. But please know that today is, is not solely for honoring the past. It's about looking towards the future. Moving forward, you're going to be challenged with complex issues in an ever-changing society. You're most certainly going to have to make some difficult decisions and choices along your way. But I know that you're up to the task and that you have the skill set to make an impact and accomplish anything. So as you enter this next chapter of your lives, I challenge you to stick to those beliefs that have landed you at this very moment in time. Determination, resolve, and a tireless work ethic, for these principles will serve you no matter what future course or path you choose. And in closing, I want to express my sincere thanks to your parents, to the teachers, administrators, and all the staff and individuals who have made this moment possible and supported you throughout your academic career. Their influence is the bedrock of your success. And I know that they join me in admiring all that you have accomplished. And as you leave the grounds here today, know this, you're capable of doing anything you set your mind to. Aim high, reach for the stars, and be bold. Never lose track of what's important to you. Congratulations and best of luck in all that you do. And now for the good part, students, please stand. President Peng, members of the Board of Education, I duly certify that the class of 2023 has completed all the local and state requirements to, see, to receive the distinction of being graduates of John P. Stevens High School. Ms. Peng, I present the John P. Stevens class of 2023. It is my privilege to begin calling the graduates. Valedictorian Sophia Arti Aurora. Salutatorian Justin Tam. Class of 2023 President Amol Nikhil Bingarde. Class Vice President. Dina Blockman. Class Secretary, Marissa Grace Chow. Class Treasurer, Tanushri Ramakrishnan. Student Council Co-President, Vivian Lee. 
Student Council Co-President Aditya Rawat. Student Council First Vice President Zoya Azim. Student Council Second Vice President Dev Barakumar Doshi. Student Council Treasurer Yushi Kandawal. National Honor Society President Samarth Jimmy Parekh. National Honor Society Vice President Jaden Pinto. National Honor Society Corresponding Secretary Yassine Zahir. National Honor Society Recording Secretary Rayma Khan. National Honor Society Treasurer Krish Nambiar. Hello. Our bunch might be small, but we can do it all. Project Pieces Homeroom. Antonio Hernandez Wheelock. Alok Call. Divit Menon. Joseph James Chalice. And Audrey Solistiono. Congratulations again to our Project Pieces students. Sharing valuable time and memories as each day begun, it was my pleasure to be your teacher, Homeroom 12-1, Nazmin Sajid Abbasi, Chichi Augustina Angiano Ayache, Kale Anthony Bianchino, Chandra Chidella, Sinai Jane Craig. Tiago Oviara Damar. Yaswan Gosukanda. Simran Hingarani. Amy Jin. Selena Lu. Saad Master. Zachary Mokrower. Neil Patel, Parth Patel, Caleb Paul, Christina Bun, Anirun Krishna Ram Kumar, Manumitha Sandashavan Gayatri, Arnav Segal, Ruhan Shinde, Renita Samasetti, Nathan Nate Tan, Sanya Arunkar, Arav Bora. Proud to announce the best homeroom ever, 12-3. We had our last goodbyes. It's the end of our journey. The last bell has rung. It's time to fly. We've chuckled and laughed and had a great time. These are the days we will never forget. Ava Nicole Abena. Om Chodhari. Samudra Chodhari. Sai Pranav Debiru, Samantha Marie Joba, McKenna Jane Graham, Emily Shea, Akil Nanagalada, 
Aman Khan, Naomi Q, Harini Nagarupala Manavana, Manisha Mazuna, Disha Mora, Gabriel Negron, Bumi Patel, Prem Patel, Hannah Michelle Piccolo Caicedo, J. H. Rana, Cheryl Saney, Arushi Sen, Darren Shum, Parth Sony, Monsi Tarigola Pula, Amrutha Vadlamani, and Sankruthi Vias. Graduating seniors, best of luck in all that you do. It is my pleasure to present Homeroom 12-2. Anna Rain Anderson. Srijan Chattopadhyay. Sai Dadi. Kevin Du. Daksh Goyal. Shriya Chachendran. Hamza Khalid. Ankit Reddy Kunduro. Olivia Lugo. Tiffany Montesinos Canseco. Sunidhi Rama Neely. Bhavit Nitin Patel. Preet Nilesh Patel. Sachi Ramturkar. Brianna Nicole Richardson. Saizmurthy Sainathani. Nervi Shah. Aditya Sharodkar. Yifan Ethan Song. Leilani Tang Sanad. Hassan Usman. Kushwant Srisai Budia. Isabel Renee Woodruff. You can't ignore Homeroom 12-4. Shraddha A. Achanta. Shreya Bobde, Jabron Chathri, Kevin Dye, Christian Marcos Granado, Ashley Huang, Lucia Unjubejuku Georgi, Michael Kondratiev. Sinjana Machabolu, Michael Mazza, Darwin Mosquera Cardoso, Mahima Mudu, Tiffany Wynn, Dev Patel, Priya Devang Patel, Jalaja Sairedi, Aryan V. Shah, Abarami Siju, Michaela Alessandra Texan, Devish Vaid, Soham Wallavalkar, Here is a great mix, homeroom 12 6. Zanara Ahmad. Paris Amadi, Niharika Banerjee, Shreyas Bola, Aryan Charan, Sai Chethan Dondamudi, Rauda El Nozahi, 
Kurt Grewal. Navia Joshi. Atharva Kundar. Siddharth Lakotu. Kaushik Mahesh. Daniel McKiernan. Pratush Mukherjee. Jagriti Mundra. Aman Nimse. Dimple Patel. Rhea Patel. Arthi Patnuro. Gia Rao. Vihan Salyan. Krushti Shah. Anshdeep Singh. Nikhil Srinivas. Anjali Raj Shaker Vajala. Vahini Walia. Anthony Warren. Congratulations, 12 5. Together you thrive. Now, as graduates, new adventures arrive. Aliyah Adams. Maham Azim. Adarsh Balaji. Samira Boga. Heat Chauhan. Lexina Dalton. Gia Dodeja. Anch Doji. Gokul Elongamban. Sergio R. Grilisha II. Danela Jones. Shirin Hajaburajava. Daniel Kusama. Lawrence Kwok. June Lowe. Sanjana Madhukar. Aryan Mukadakar. Kisna Nihilani. Druhi Patel. Hamna Punawala. Ashi Rao. Sanath Saji. Rathika Shah. Adriti Kushi Singh. Caleb Spears. Kanan Faja. Matthew Walsack. All right, I have no clever rhyme, but I do have a great bunch of kids. Homeroom 12-7. Fiza Alam. Navoni Banerjee. Isha Ulu. Sydney Chang. Marvin's Dangerville. Jacob Engel. Tanvi Gudavali. Manis Gupta. Aziz Ibrahim. Simran Joshi. Ramya Lakshmi. Aman Mahmood. Bhavya Mehta. Samik Mukherjee. Jaya Nishal. Divya Patel. Rohan Patel. Dia Putangadi. Aaron Ravindran. Pramit Samanta. Neva Shah. Arman Singh. Abishri Teki. Finally, Lawrence Wang.
The homeroom that's so fine, homeroom 12-9. Gayanjali, Reddy, Ala. Zachary, Luca, Bardish. Justin, Anthony, Benito. Nikhil, Chabra. Rashida, Dasgupta. Uday, Gajolva. Marcella, Iverson. Tanme, Joshi. Dia, Jaspal, Kana. Paul Luis, Gargayano, Ledesma. Ajit, Malavarapu. Shlok, Mehta. Toshani, Mukherjee. Mildred, Consolata, Ogari. Hirsch, Patel. Hina, Patel. Janvi, Patel. Sonica Patel, Brianna Nicole Petroselli, Parth Anil Kumar Prajapathi, Parth Rawat, Chloe Sanchez, Yugal Nilesh Shah, Gurneet Kaur Singh. Priyanka Sriram, Gilbert Tang, Anika Valuru, Sharon Wei. Homeroom 12 8 is great. Ritvik Agrawa. Parsha Alam, Anya Bansal, Tabitha Bonet, Jennifer Darkwa, Anurad Guduru, Vivek Isukapali, Soham Joshi. Lahitika Kalapu, Saksham Kulkani, Abhigyan Lanki, Siddhi Malik, Winifred Daria May. Winifred is also receiving her associate's degree from Middlesex College. Pranav Mehta, Shrestha Mukherjee, Ashwin Nari, Hari Patel, Saki Patel, Shreya Sumpath Kumar, Veer Shah, Aryan Singh, Rahul Sinarasan, Raj Teladarvia, Medha Valuri, Justin Paul Weeks. Congratulations, today is your day. You're off to great places, you're off and away. Ladies and gentlemen, homeroom 1210. Kushal Aluru. Sana Saish Orkar. Akita Chinakotla. Akshashri Ganesh. Arush Rahul Gunay. Akshay Iyer. Calvin Rajarigam Jew. Rija Karel. Sathik Sai Malela. <laughs> Kelly Michelle Membreno. <laughs> Nikhil Reddy Mula. Sri Tanishka Mumidi. Dikshita Oku. Sarang Patel. 
Nikhil Prasad. Kyle Thomas Rolinavich. Kamya Rao Ryerson. Rhea Sansgiri. Arya Amit Shahane. Dia Sharma. Jazz Singh. Bakhtia Sorori. Advika Srivastava. Ruchir Thakur. Marvin Joshua Valerio. Pernith Reddy Bunguru. Into high school jargon, we shall delve. Hey, bro, we got the most riz in homeroom 1212. Meha on end. Iksha Batra. Kadeja Diamond Bradley. Ishan Chatali. Danya Desai, Hari Anamani, Devanch Gupta, Sara Ismail, Kanan Jadeja, Nishanth Justin, David Marcus Lefkowitz. Nile Malu Soheb Munir Siddharth Pagara Daksh Patel Shiv Patel Navid Jerry Pulley Kotil Krish Reddy Anika Santhanam, Archisha Sharma, Ashika Srivastava, Ananya Singh All, Sri Krishna Subrahamian, Naveen Thalam, Dia Vashith. Andrew Shong. You've heard the rest, now here's the best. 1211. Varenya Amagauni. Kushal Bathi. Jamar Bowen. Shreya Chintawar. Ryan Del Piano, Ashmi Nishith Desai, Mahalaksmi Ganesan, Aryan Gupta, Arushi Kara, Ayushi Malik, Saketnath Paba, Haloni Patel. Kushbu A. Patel, Shalja H. Patel, Shreya Prasad, Namrita Ramkumar, Paris Kantni Carmela Raymond, Joshua Isaac Santana Grulan, Risha Singh. Adarsh Siva Subramani, Savion Diorin Span McKeever, Anika Nilesh Thakur, 
Srisai by Bobby Varanasi. Sajeda C. Whitlock. And Ella Jung Wong. They're mean, they're lean, they're 12, 13. Rohan Anand. Anthony Vincent Bella. Joshua Braverman. Panini Trivikram Chaturi. Pratham Narav Desai. Gia Garg. Muskan Gupta, Thanesh Kaliselvan, Philip Kim, Sylvester Lopajak, Ashish Manavarthi, Faraz Merchant, Sai Srihan Mainini, Evelyn Minthu Guyen. Pritam Palani, Isha Patel, Shiv R. Patel, Precious Amani Perry, Aditi Santosh, Atharva Sharma, Aditya Nitesh Singla, Girish R. Subramani, Neha Velagapuri, Jenny Zhu. All, welcome home room 1214, the class who always looks fresh, smart, clean, and lean. Siram Ande. Rhea. Bagia, Nadia Budan, Ellie Chu, Joshua Delafu, Aliyah M. Doman, Rhea Gupta, Nashika Jain, Isha Kamath. Arshal Kamdar, Vanita Keza K. Puram, Akshat Kumar, Sari Saikaran Mandapati, Ishan Ravindra Matri, Siddharth Nachanagari, Sheja Gabriela Palmer, Kunj Patel, Jazz Purawal, Nadesh Saravana, Avi Jayesh Kumar Sharma, Saveel Sinha, Aditya Tharakar, Neha Vamarui, Sophie Yang. What can I say about Homeroom 1216? They are talented and determined. Now watch them accomplish their dreams. Lakshmi Megana Adikarla. Nitya Angadala. Robin Bell Bala Marugan, Reva Bala Rao, Tiara Lee Birch, Harsh Choksi, Anish Durham, Riddhi Gavande. Andreas Haji Lucas, 
Sana Ibrahim. Rohan Jain. Varun Kolachina. Matthew Aaron Miller. Vivek Najireddy. Manasvi Vijay Naik. Sophia Pan. Mahi Patel. Sneha Patel. Ivan Raman. Jocelyn Daniela Sabuyon Correa. Arko Sarkar. Ishida Sharma. Isha Sadakar. Shashwath Thiagarajan. With their wit, flair, and intelligence, they always steal the scene. I'm so excited to present Homeroom 1215. So, Avery Elizabeth Anderson. Darsh Palala. Nico Paul Buglioli. Joshua Sungjin Cho. Harsh Ganshambai Darji. Essence Monique Garretson. Stavia Gupta. Puri Jane. Reet Kampani. Srinitya Koduri. Tyler Peter Leus. Saketh Manero. Jillian Victoria Mealy. Ankur Anil Metra. Madhu Suhas Reddy Nachan Nagari. Kush Dharmesh Patel. Siddhi R. Patel. Somya Raghuraman. Emma Sophia Rosigliano. COVID Serene. Mahi Manish Shet. Niri Niraj Shet. Jonathan Michael Sinyavsky. Priya Subramanian. Charlotte Simone Tillery. Kirtana Vinkadesan. Keith Yao. It's my pleasure to introduce Homeroom 1217, William Angelo. Anarud Naga Venkata Ramasai Boom Midipati. Gabriel Chan. Badang Chintala. Agrim Chopra. Yash Raul Dewan. Isha Gavez. Ragava Kalandindi. Tynesia Isha Kersit. Pranavi Kandapali. Lauren Lee. Veena Mani Kandan. Priyanka Anand Mirji. Tane Naik. Aleem Nawaz. Krishna Patel. Suraj Tejas Patel. C. 
Siddhant Rai. Kaylee Zora Riera. Kushi Sharma. Zaria Cherie Shumate Smith. Krithika Sista. Tarun Tata. Mahina Thoguru. Arian Vidge. I take great pride in introducing Homeroom 1219, Nishant Mira Bhargava, Anika Chakraborty, Vaishnavi Chokhiger, Nicolette Eileen DeSirio. Aishika Ganti, Zujing Han, Moksha Jansari, Saidarsha Karunakaran, Samuel Krasner, Kenneth Lagayu, Adarsh Mana. Avi Mishra, Aryan Nair, Shlok Parab, Malesh Patel, Nishashri Prabhakaran, Shirin Reina, Suhitha Reddy, Lochani Satish Kumar, Tristy Sharma, Hema Sankar, Karthik Sevilasetti, Kyra Snipes, Saisha Thupral, Aman Zaid. It is my honor to introduce Homeroom 1218. Sometimes late, but always great. Kamali Anam. Suyash Bardwaj. Michael Bright. Dorian Castro. Neve Chopra. Arushi Das, Fizan Asad Din, Churchill Shere George, Lauren Alexa Hamer, Josh Jana, Zian Karim Junma, Shea Karanam, Shivanji Kori. Peter James Ligel, Pramod Miriala, Anvashi Nain, Lauren Amelie Nooch, Mahi Patel, Viraj Patel, Pradyush Pathak, Simrit Rai, Heather Ann Reese, Crystal Sar, Prisha Shamar, Sahana Shivakumar, Kapis Sukavasi, Pranav Vijayanath.
Gracious and kind, with focus aplenty, I'm proud to present Homeroom 1220. Mushtaba Amadi. Mahika Aurora. Vaibhav Batla. Ankita Chakavorti. Nancy Diwali. Oshmi Ghosh. Rana Honda. Tapan Chappi. Ayush Karupakula. Arush Kukreja. Christina Lim. Sanskriti Mansukani. Ayush Mishra. Ishan Patil. I'm sorry, Ishan Parikh. Amaya Patil. Isha Kanan Rajesh Kanan. Sarah Rodriguez. Yogitha Sagi. Anushika Satuvali. Luke Shen. Jamea Slappy. Nahitha Sunil. Shawshank Theramali. Rian Zahid. Skip Krishna. Krishna? I'm sorry, Krishna Mansukhani. been fun, but your journey has only just begun. Reach for the stars, shine as bright as the sun. Congratulations, Homeroom 1221. Shreya Batla Penumarti. Lauren Parlin. Rakesh Kumar Kavala Ramesh Kumar. Dhruv Doda. Jack Ryan Dottoli. Anjana Srijip Dereesan. Kavya Harihara. Matthew Brandon Jason. Yoship Sai Reddy Kasi Reddy. Angeline Kukreja. Chirag Limbachia. Zed Mansuri. Devanchi Mishra. Dilraj Nanda. Paridi Parekh. Neha Patel. Ella Mo Paul. Krithik Rajkumar. Emily Rodriguez. Shriya Sathya Narayanan. Dara Sheff. Lindsay Small. Aditya Suratkal. Arush Tippa. Asher Ali Zaidi. Wishing 1222 the best at whatever they choose to do. Aditya Ram Ashuk. <laughs> Nalakshi Bhattacharji. Smithy Reddy Chandareddy. Maya Christian. <laughs> Lorena Dos Santos. <laughs> Mustafa Jame. <laughs> Sonica Gadbole. <laughs> Eamon Hassan. Abhi Rami Jaya Kumar, Ishan Kataria, Aldrich Liu, 
Timothy Joseph Martin. Krishnashri Moganti. Akshay Nalabolu. Navdeep Singh Nanda. Nikki D. Patel. Om Vani Pegnakar. Fatima Raza. Gia Saxena. Rian K. Sheth. Aliyah Erin Jemiah Smith. Jack Sventi. Isha Trivedi. And Andrew Zhang. They've reached great heights, they'll now explore. The world is theirs, we know they'll soar. With joy and pride, we all adore, presenting homeroom 1224. Shravani Sandeep Ashtekar. Himani Palchandra Pave. Tejas Bogel. Masa Azul Ignacio Champa Jaramillo. Neha Chandrakant. Liv Chung. Curtis Tyler Tavon Good. Omar M. Hassan. Sara Javeri. Nikita Lakshmi Kumar. Sarah Isabel Liu. Hari Mohan. Stephen Navarro Barahona. Dev Parikh. Om Jayesh Kumar Patel. Shyam Patel. Abhinav Ramanathan. Nayab Sabuwala. Saket Saini. Amulya Yogita Siram. Ryan Shin. Nishika Solanki. Priyanka Suresh. And Lasya Udupa. Ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce you to the best of 23. So let's give it up for Homeroom 1223. Anjal Agarwal. Tanush Ashok. Ayan Chandra. Arnav Doshi. Alicia Gomes. Jabron Hassan. Jitesh Jensen Das. Sonia Kataria. Dia Kumar. Anant Mashalkar. Rita Mohammed, Madhav Narian, Matthew Scott Jahari Nelson, Renika Parad, Om Patel. Kyla Marie Pena. Aaron Rano. Muhammad Ali Syed. Brandon Shin. Mana Talib. 
Desmond Singh. Aditya Bashaham. And Rebecca Zhao. Last but not least, it is my pleasure to present Homeroom 1225. Prada Bor. Mahir Chanduka. Riley Calling. Akel Gopal. Jasir Romeo Greer. Anireth Habatam. Nathan Jiang. Neely Kishwiker. Divyanur Kaur. Sansita Kumar. Shannon Jade Lu. Cindy Carmen McKnight. Purav Mohanti. Urja Nayak. Puri Kunal Patel. Andrew Fan. Ishan Sachdevya. Yu Shah. Daniel Shabazz. Ishan Pandurang Shanday. Fidant Sonani. Menor Navid Sayed. Laya Thaminidi. Tene Umatar. Anesh Verma. And Felix Zhu. And now, we call the president of the class of 2023, Amol Nikhil Bingarde. Hello everyone, my name is Amol Bingarde and I am the class of 2023 president. And before I get started, like everyone else, I just want to take a selfie real quick. Everyone smile. All right, that sounds good. Um, and again, before I start, I wanted to say thank you to a bunch of the people that have shaped me into the person I am today. All the teachers and admins that are here today, my parents and my grandparents that are in the stands today, um, and all of my other fellow peers in the class of 2023. Thank you, everyone. Now, if you look down at the program, you'll see that my speech is entitled An Ode to J.P. Stevens. What you are about to hear is an ode to JP, yes, but an ode more specifically to its hallways. The hallways of John P. Stevens High School, as I'm sure all the students and teachers here are well aware, are a war zone. Each time the bell rings, you never know what to expect. We are penguins in a huddle, shuffling down the hallways against traffic that rivals a 7.30 a.m. Grove Avenue. The hallways are, safe to say, less than ideal, they're crowded, sweaty, and generally not the most pleasant place to be. But still, we find a way to make the best of them. Somehow, all 676 of us, well, most of us, have taken this mess and found a way to make it to class on time. My historic junior year sprint from the band room to the B wing was a testament to this. But our relationship to the hallways hasn't always been this successful. Let me take you all back to a time of prehistory and ancient delight, 2019. 
Our freshman year, the hallways may as well have been an untamed jungle, replete with mysterious sounds, the band and orchestra playing down the art wing, and mysterious fruits, delicious smells from the food sciences classrooms. Now, I personally am a chronically lost person, and the daunting mess of hallways that lay before me only exacerbated that issue. One month into freshman year, I'd probably gotten more lost more often than I'd ever found myself in the rest of high school, semester two of physics notwithstanding. We were thrust into a totally new and unfamiliar environment, but as time went on, we learned the nooks and crannies. We started cutting across the courtyard. We learned to avoid at all costs the cafeteria intersection after a lunch period. By March of our freshman year, it was all starting to come together. Then came, as I'm sure you all well recall, the COVID-19 pandemic. Suddenly, everything we knew was thrown out the window. Our hallways became a confusing array of Zoom links and Google Meets as we frantically tried to figure out which link to join at 7.50 a.m. To make the most of the cards we were dealt, we had to once more readjust and readapt. And that we did. Soon enough, we were masters of the digital hallways, finding our way around better than we ever could have imagined while we were back in person. But as junior year came around, we found ourselves back at square one. We were those young freshmen all over again, standing at the foot of a school that was just as unfamiliar, if not more unfamiliar, than it had been back in 2019. But as much as we could have let that be another major barrier to our readjustment, we once more pushed through that phase of unfamiliarity and commanded our surroundings, making the hallways our own once again. And that brings us all to senior year, our first year where we've maintained some sense of stability. This year, we faced the traditional senior stressors, college apps, jobs, figuring out what to wear to prom. But thankfully, we've had nothing thrown at us to majorly shake our junior year familiarity. Looking back at our past responses to unfamiliarities, however, even if something especially terrible had been thrown at us this year, I have no doubt that we would have been handling it perfectly fine. And I believe that for one reason, we are J.P. Stevens students. Once each and every one of you steps out of this building, you may perhaps forget the name of the first settlement in the United States or the formulas for rotational motion. But you'll never forget what our hallways taught you. Resilience, adaptability, flexibility, versatility. It's these qualities that embody the quintessential JP student, and it's these qualities that will set you up for success as you all pursue your post-graduation goals. Whether you choose to attend college, trade school, join the military, or take any of the other innumerable paths that now lay before you, the one common denominator is that your hallways will be constantly changing. Never forget what this school has taught you. Be the person that leads others to adjust to new hallways just as well as you have adjusted these past four years. Earlier on, I pointed to this speech being perhaps more specific than listed in the program. I dubbed it an ode to the hallways of J.P. Stevens rather than just to the school itself. I'd like to amend that statement. This is, rather, an ode to the students that roam those halls. This is an ode to the students that have constantly adapted and made the best of all those changing hallways. And perhaps most importantly, this is an ode to the students that will continue to make the best of all the changing hallways they'll face in life, both for themselves and for others. This is an ode to the J.P. Stevens student and an ode to the class of 2023. Thank you, everyone. Graduates, please stand. You may now move your tassels from right to left. Congratulations, class of 2023. At this time, we call up our Cadence group.